start of this Memorial Day weekend. A Philadelphia high school is honoring former graduates and veterans who are gone but not forgotten. The original Edison High had the most fatalities of all high schools in the country during the Vietnam War. Action News reporter Catherine Scott has this story. They're known as the Edison 64, the 64 former students of Edison High School who paid the ultimate sacrifice in the Vietnam War. <laughs> students, teachers and veterans gathered at the Hunting Park School to pay tribute ahead of Memorial Day. I feel like it serves to remember those people who are no longer here and also to celebrate them because they gave their lives for something way bigger than them. The Edison 64 are an important part of the fabric of this school. The original all-male Edison High over at 8th and Lehigh experienced the most fatalities of all the high schools in the country during the Vietnam War. No other high school in this nation lost as many students. We make sure that not a year go by that we don't you know, honor their sacrifice. Action News has covered this ceremony before. This video of this school tradition that has stretched for decades and grown. This year marks 50 years since the end of America's direct involvement in the Vietnam War. It's important, one, to carry on their legacy to honor those 64, and also just for the School of Edison um, to continue that tradition. Organizers say part of the education here is for students to recognize their connections with these fallen heroes who were around the same age when they left Philadelphia to serve. We wanted to see themselves in these young men. It's not, they, if they were still alive, they would be their grandfathers. That part of history is important to keep at the forefront for our students as they learn history, and particularly the history in this community. In Hunting Park, Catherine Scott, Channel 6 Action News.